So, hi again. We're going to make or show you how we make a French 75 now. So this is our signature serve. It's, it's quite different from a classic French 75. In fact, it's not really the same at all. It just has the same sort of structure of the, of the original drink. So what we do is we, uh, we mix everything together. We clarify the lemon juice in the mix. Um, and then we carbonate and bottle it here in the house. I'm going to talk you through the process, the ingredients, uh, and then we'll show you the serve as well. So we mix everything together uh, and then we strain it through. So what we've got in here is we have Star of Bombay Gin. Um, and we have this uh, Canadian Bajou. So this is um, it's ice harvested, so like you would make an ice wine. Um, it's really important because it, it, gives, it gives the Bajou a high pectin content, which matters when we, when we split it. I'll talk about that in, in a little bit. There's a dry Moscato wine, uh, orange flower water, sugar, um, fresh lemon juice, um, water. So what we do is we mix everything together. Now the pectin content in the Vajou, uh, combined with the alcohol and the lemon juice, splits the lemon juice. So what you can see here is like a crystal clear, crystal clear, it's red tinted, but, it, but it, there's no sediment in it whatsoever. And if you look in the top, um, you've got kind of all the lemon juice sediment separated out. So that's really important so we get a decent carbonation. So once we've strained it through, this takes kind of maybe two or three hours, depending, I think, on the humidity, but we've not quite figured it out. Sometimes it's quick, sometimes it's slow. Once we've got it through, we chill it down to fridge temperature, so maybe between two and four degrees, uh, and then we carbonate it. So we carbonate it in plastic, uh, using like a ball lock connector. Um, so we carbonate it three times once it's cold. So as you can see, we've got some carbonation there. Make sure all of the air is out of there. And then we've got a, a beer keg hooked up to the joint. And then we click, click on, and then we get some decent carbonation in there. So we wait for this to reach pressure, agitate it, agitate it, get it in the fridge, and then you need to let it settle for a couple of hours if possible. And that means the CO2 will dissolve into the liquid. Uh, and then you get like a, a really solid carbonation. Once we've done that, we transfer it to a glass bottle. So we bottle it here, we've got it labeled. So there's the French 75, we make it three sheets in house. Um, and then we just serve it at the table, straight as you would do with a glass of champagne. And there we go.